Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So both Microsoft and Google are working on better organizing tabs with AI in their respective browsers being Edge and Chrome. And a couple of days ago, I posted a video where we had a look at a comparison as to how you organize tabs in Microsoft Edge using AI compared to how you organize tabs in Chrome using AI. And I'll leave that video down below. Now, the reason I'm mentioning that video is because Microsoft has recently made a very small change to the organizing tabs feature. And currently in Edge Canary 123, which is the latest preview version, if we head up to our tab actions menu in the top left, we can see that it's still called group similar tabs. Now, something I have noticed is that the preview has been taken away. So this used to be called Group Similar Tabs Preview. So obviously that's become a lot more stable. And because it's become a lot more stable, um, Group Similar Tabs, if we pop over quickly to the stable version, which is currently sitting on Edge version 121, and we head to our Tab Actions menu, Group Similar Tabs has now just been simply called Organized Tabs, which is exactly the same as what it's called over in Chrome. So... Obviously now Microsoft and Google get in on the same page with this, especially now that it's become more stable and is out of preview in Microsoft Edge. And obviously if we click on Organize Tabs, that uses artificial intelligence to pop those automatically into the different tab groups. And then we can group tabs accordingly. And there we have our tab groups. And I thought that was interesting. It's out of preview now and obviously should be a little bit more stable. And now in the stable version, has received a different name, Organized Tabs. And it's not exactly clear when this rolled out. So this could possibly have been a server-side update and obviously is not attached to any um, recent update, but I could be, could be open to correction on that. But nonetheless, um, the Group Similar Tabs is now Organized Tabs in the stable version of Edge, putting it now in line um, as a similar feature now compared to Google Chrome. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.